Welcome to Devices Setup channel and today we will learn how to set up beta.iot Wi-Fi extender. So you can set up this device via two methods. First is via WPS and second is via browser. To start the process, make sure your extender is plugged in into a power source and your router should be set up beforehand. Now you need to press the WPS button on the router once and within two minutes, press the WPS button on your beta.iot Wi-Fi extender. The light will start blinking on both the devices and on successful setup, the light will stop blinking and you will get a solid internet LED on the Wi-Fi extender. And the extender network after successful setup will show up with a beta.iot suffix after your home network SSID. So you can now connect your phones, computer, etc. to the extender's network name using the same password as your router's Wi-Fi password. Now, if this method is not working for you, then it can be possible that the WPS is disabled on your router. So for that, watch video in the description to learn how to enable WPS again on your router or else you can try the browser setup next. So to start with, you can use your phone or computer, then go to the Wi-Fi list. There, you will find your extender's network name it might come up as beta.iot or beta.iot 5G or sometimes as Wi-Fi underscore some digits or Wi-Fi underscore digits hyphen 5G. So tap on it to connect to it. Once connected, open a browser and into the URL or address bar type 192.168.188.1 and hit enter and on the login window for username and password type admin next it will show you the list of all the available network so select your home network ssid and type its password for verification and once you hit save settings it will take around a minute for the extender to get connected to your router once done you will see a new network SSID showing up in your Wi-Fi list. It will have beta.iot or some other suffix along with your router's Wi-Fi SSID. So you can now try connecting your devices to this extender's network using the same password as your Wi-Fi router password. And just in case your extender is not working, then you can reset it by putting a paper clip inside the reset hole for around 10 seconds while it is plugged in into a power source. After 10 seconds, release the pin and let the extender reboot and then try the setup again after 2 minutes. Finally, if you found this video useful, then please do like and subscribe to support my efforts. So see you guys in the next video. Until then, have a blessed day.